is up guys it is aj from mma experts and we are talking about the fight between danny henry and makwan mr finland amir khani should be a good one here i'm really excited for this matchup to be honest but i think it's a total whitewash i'm going to tell you that right out i think that danny henry is not on the level of makwan amir khani i'm going out on a limb and saying that i watch footage his stand-up is not at the level of Makwan and his grappling is not at the level. Yeah, he's got two UFC wins. You got that quick submission of a uh, Hakeem Dewado, but I'm not trying to be a dick, but it, it was kind of like it was a fluke thing. It happens now. I'm not saying discredit the win. That win's sweet. God bless. But it doesn't mean that he's this good of a fighter. He lost his last fight in like a minute to Ige. I think Makwan Amir Khan is gonna beat him up too. But we're gonna break it down a bit. We're gonna go farther than just me saying that. So Henry, solid submission skills himself, decent power with his straights. Um, is susceptible to leg kicks and has like an awkward style on the feet to be honest with you He has been caught. He has been stunned in the past a little bit taller than Mako Amir Khani And he's got a 0.9 reach. So let's just say he has a 71 inch reach I don't know why 70.9 is a thing here, but they put it on there uh, Makwan's actually got the reach advantage too, which take that into consideration on the feet um, And he can be taken down and controlled and Makwan is a guy that takes you down and controls you I mean he had Shane Burgos down and Burgos is nasty and he had him controlled a bit. Now, he lost that fight. But at the end of the day, pretty pretty respectable in my opinion. He's going to look for takedowns. He looks for grappling exchanges. He's trying to get you by submission. He's trying to tap you out. And he's really strong. He can get gas, though. That's the one thing about him. But I don't think this matchup, he's really at too much risk. I don't think Henry has the skills to compete. I think Makwan Amir Khani dominates this fight. I think he wins in the first or second round. I'm actually going to go out and live and say he wins in the first by submission. That's going to be my actual pick. But first or second. Um, he is a moderate favorite. I think that he, he's going to get it done. I feel like Danny Henry's a tough kid, but he's not on his level, man. Makwan Amir Khani at one point was thought of as like he's a future title challenger. And that hype has kind of faded. And he's kind of maybe became a bit of a mid-level guy. But I do believe he's top 15 material. I think he just has to get a couple together. Um, I mean, he fought Shane Burgos and gave him a good fight. And Shane Burgos is top 10. So I feel like he's good. Danny Henry... You know, he's a, a tough kid. He comes to fight, but he's not going to win this one. He loses. First round submission loss. Makwan Amir Khani gets it done. I'm excited for it. It's going to be a fun fight. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications, and I will see you guys in the next video.